400,000 years after the Big Bang. The universe had enough hydrogen and helium, but it was irregularly distributed. Several overdense regions gravitationally collapsed to form the first stars of the universe. Temperature in the early universe was too high for self-formation of gravitationally bound objects. Dark matter provided the additional gravity required. Stars came together to form clusters. Clusters came together to form small galaxies. These small galaxies started merging. Milky Way galaxy was growing in size. The early Milky Way galaxy was roughly spherical in shape. However, 8.8 billion years ago, something happened. Our galaxy gained so much mass that it started spinning quickly. It collapsed from a spherical shaped galaxy to a disc shaped galaxy that we see today. New and younger stars like our sun started forming in this disk. Today, Milky Way galaxy is still consuming material from a number of dwarf galaxies. It hosts a supermassive black hole at its center, which is about 4 million times the mass of the sun. About 4 billion years from now, Milky Way galaxy and the neighboring Andromeda galaxy will collide with each other. About 7 billion years from now, the collision between these huge galaxies will result into the formation of a new elliptical galaxy named Milkomeda. This will be the fate of our galaxy.